the, the theme and the thing that Pat opened with here is this is the story of that he would plan to cover in his keynote at the Intel Developer Forum. Basically, um, increasingly as more of computing is connected to the internet, we're seeing uh, a synergy in being able to offer our IA products in a wide range of applications. Traditionally, you would look at us and you look at Intel's dynamic range of applications as being from uh, mobile up to server. Mm. Okay? But increasingly with Itanium, and we're going to describe Tukwela here, we're going to also, we also talked a little bit about Inhale and EX, we're moving up into mission critical and HPC. And the other thing that's interesting with our silicon technology, we're seeing more and more an advantage of low, in the low power area, and we're able to move down into these lower power devices, including smartphones and netbooks. So his theme is going to be showing how we can apply IA to computing needs connected to the internet from the milliwatt application to the HPC petaflop application. And the cool thing about this is that for our you know, IA all the way through Xeon, it's a, um, it's a single code base. And wherever you go on the internet, you get the true internet on your mobile internet device, as opposed to some version that doesn't play very well because it's being translated to a different instruction set. So we're pretty excited about this. And we think that two things that are underlying that are very important uh, one is our leadership in silicon technology, which gives us a fundamental leadership in energy-efficient microprocessors and, and, uh, and peripherals. And the second is our ability to design these platforms, uh, whether it be an MID or whether it be a notebook or whether it be a server. We kind of co-engineer a processor, chipset, power management algorithms, you name it, that's really optimized for that segment, right? And then we have, in the end, the processor and chipset to sell. So those two, you know, Intel strengths really play uh, across this whole range uh, in the internet environment. 